I don't feel like I'm being valued as a human being there or as a homie, then I'm cool. Sheesh! So AD has left No Jumper. The Chris Paul of No Jumper is gone. If you don't remember, AD was the one who always stood on the front lines for No Jumper. When them 50 Mexicans came up in there, AD was the only brother in there. It could have went bad for homie. When 16 spit on Flacco, who was there? AD was the one who had to save Flacco. Man, this man done stood in a lot of fire for Adam 22. And to be done like that, I ain't feeling it. AD did the right thing. He's going to get up out of there. He's doing big with his uh, YouTube. I've been always watching his show. Also with the Fed community, I'm feeling them as well. So, hey, man, I think No Jumper finna go in another direction. You know, they bringing up Nazis and racist white people. And you feel me? That's maybe the bravery they finna go in. I don't respect it. But guess what? AD going, and I respect that. Chet Bride Music Review. Sheesh! One of the legends, one of the ghosts is back and better than ever. Usher just dropped a new single, Goo, and we gotta talk about this one. Okay, so we already know, Usher's a goat. Usher's a legend. He has a track record. The 90s, he popped it off. The 2000s, he dominated. 2010, still dropping his. And now in the 2020s, Usher's trying something new. This summer, Usher's giving a lady something real sexy with goo. He's singing falsetto, letting the ladies know, hey, I'm still Mr. Sexy. I still do my thing. Hey, Usher sound better than ever on this one. He sound rejuvenated, sound real healthy, sound real good, something real sexy and smooth for the ladies. I might have to put a suit on in this one. You feel me? This shit is a vibe. I'm going to give this song a four out of five. Man, I'm looking forward to Usher's new album now. Somebody going to be like, what? You better check your naked Man, Russ going out sad on this one. See, when a female is in an abusive relationship, we all see it because it's usually physical, right? But when a man is in an abusive relationship, you will never know. You feel me? Because he going to stay quiet. But we see it. We, we know what's going on. And Russ right now is in an abusive relationship with his woman. See, understand, Russ plays quarterback. That means he's the leader of other men. Other men have to come to him like the alpha, like he's the apex. When they see this, they can't respect it. That's why Russ has lost his locker room in Denver. They can't respect him as a man. And when his woman is doing stuff like this to belittle him in public, it shames him. Other men are like, come on, bro. I can't respect that, man. And look at him right now. He looks depressed. It looks he has no control over his relationship. Other men can't respect that, man. If you can't hold it down in your household, how you going to tell me something? Okay, so there's an argument going on right now. Who's the better group, SWV or Escape? Now, me being a 90s music connoisseur, I got the answer for y'all. Okay, so SWV did they thing in the 90s. They had hit songs like Weak, I'm So Into You, Rain, You're Always On My Mind. I mean, it was one of the biggest female groups in the 90s. But hold up, hold up. Escape also had some big hits in the 90s. Understand it. My little secret, who can I run to? And then they had that big, huge hit. Just kicking it. Escape was hard. But the question is, who had the better run? It's a tough one, but I got the answer for y'all. And the winner is SWV by just a little bit. And for one reason and one reason only, that flip of Michael Jackson human nature right there, whoo, that is the best flip of that song. Many people have tried it, but none have done it like SWV. Man, they was big.